So I did packaging, I don't know when I did it, a while ago. Um, it's a water brand, a sparkling water brand cool. called Asarasi. So I did the packaging for it a while ago, but I, I need I need to make them because they look really bad in the mock-up I have. <laughs> oh sweet! No, that's great that you already have it designed and stuff. Yeah. So we'll see. Brenna, I thought you were Bjork when I first logged on. <laughs> what does that mean? Bjork. Yeah. Is that not good? Is that a person? <laughs> oh, it's a. Uh... Hang on. Hang on, I'll pull up a picture. Hold yeah. up, hold up. I was just about to be like, you have to see Bjork. <laughs> She's an Icelander. Morgan! Hi. <laughs> what do you guys think? Brenna? Bjork? Any, anybody? Wait, it's not showing. Um, I'm going to... Yeah, no, I just barely found one, actually. Oh, God. Here's... Uh, I don't know. This will have to do. Uh, yeah. She's known for her eccentricity. Hello. She's a, yes, a, an eccentric musician. Hello. That that's what I look like. <laughs> <laughs> um, let's see. Where's a better one? Where's a better I'm Brenna scared. picture? I'm gonna go off video. <laughs> no, there's one it's... in the top left, right there. This one. <laughs> Basically the same. Basically, kind of the same yeah. hair. So uh, mostly the mostly the hair. It's cute, Bren. It's cute. That's what I'm what we're trying to say here. <laughs> oh, my video's off. On sale. On sale! <laughs> <laughs> Wanted to make sure everybody saw all the people involved. <laughs> So how was how was week ending? How was weekend in quarantine? It was great. Thumbs up. Deb gives I one thumbs up. I addressed and stamped all of my tentative wedding invitations. Oh my Sweet. goodness. <laughs> Good job, Deb. As if, like the world is still alive. Yeah, we'll we'll see if it happens, but <laughs> I spent too much money on these to have to redo them, so we're sending them out. <laughs> Postal service still exists, huh? Yeah, it's still it's still running. It's Rain pretty good. Shine. Yeah. The virus. But Rob letter pressed them and they look so good. I'm obsessed with them. <laughs> yeah, they're letter pressed by Trist Press. You gotta send them out. I hate that uh that you gotta. he's a cool dude. <laughs> oh Rob, yeah. He's he is. What? Nothing. We were agreeing with you. Morgan's in California. Oh, oh. oh I can tell by He's the background. <laughs> the crayon is gone. <laughs> green here. Are you in Southern California? Yeah. Bram, are you in San Diego? No, I'm in Orem. Oh, that's okay. <laughs> okay. Let's let's watch a movie to get started. Maybe if we play it, they will come. No, we have like no one here. It really shows when we're all on one screen. <laughs> There's six of us. Oh, there's five of us, because you know Luke. Luke is a student of life, but not of this class. <laughs> student of life. Isn't there that billboard? <laughs> there's a the billboard that talks about <laughs> the Wait, classroom. Luke, are you wearing a print shirt? Yes. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. Prince is the sure coolest person ever. <laughs> Prince Rogers Nelson. <laughs> Should I try my background? Do you think I'm still the same color as my wall? Yeah. Try it, Brenna. Try it. <laughs> yeah, I'm still white. 
why yours does that. Okay. <laughs> I don't know. I think I don't know why I would do that. Yeah, I, like it's never Try done that to me. Because you're really not the same color as that door behind you. <laughs> Is it the background? That doesn't make sense. No, yeah, because like, look at Bram's background and it looks just like Brenna's. It's just like, or mine even. <laughs> That's cool, Brenna. Okay, well, we'll just not do that. Okay, let's watch this cool movie. a dog but you guys know what photogrammetry is no no <laughs> it's uh you know what instagram is it's instagrammetry it's when you scan a 3d model like you can do it with your phone now i think but essentially you scan a person with all their and the the textures are photographic, but there's also depth. I guess you can't do it with your camera because there's depth data there. But essentially, it's just like a rough scan. If you've ever seen, been to like a 3D, I don't know if they have it in the library, but most 3D scanner, uh, 3D printing labs will have a scanner there. So you can put like a small object and a scanner will rotate around capturing all the 3D data and it gives you a sort of a weird looking mesh. That's how that video was made that we just watched photogrammetry try it today we actually have a 3d scanner in my office right now if you're interested in scanning yourself or someone you love <laughs> for photogrammetry purposes wait can you scan yourself well someone else would have to do it but yes wow Is it like a like a moving camera you like pick up it's kind of like a giant, if you imagine a giant 
cartoon red magnet, you know, a horseshoe shape, but it's not shaped like a horseshoe at all. It's actually more like a construction stapler, like this big thing that you just wave around. Mm. Anyway, it's in my office and none of us can, none of us are there right now. <laughs> Nothing physical will happen this semester, all virtual. Colton, Dom, welcome. Beth, welcome. Beth is not moving a whole lot today. <laughs> she got the black and white filter on as well. Uh, I wanted to take questions. Sorry, here. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. You know what? If you're just not feeling it, like Ben last time, if you want to show us your avatar, <laughs> it's fine. That's fine. <laughs> We're lenient these days. I wanted to give those of you who did not show your Mosrum posters a chance to show them. And then I wanted to kick off the packaging assignment officially. Let's see, we saw Brenna's, Morgan's, I changed Jared's. Mine. You changed yours? Yeah. We and saw I Deb's. Oh, well, we, yeah, so some of you, a lot of you showed two, two thirds of the motion poster project. And if you'd like to show the remaining third today, we should do that before jumping into packaging. It looks like everybody's still in the same, nobody traveled. In my other class, a couple of people went home, which was very far away and it was very disruptive. But have you guys been staying put since the last time we talked? Okay. Morgan shakes her head. <laughs> Besides Morgan, who's in California. <laughs> All right, whoever would like to go first, let's do it. Dom. Hi, Dom. <clears throat> Hola. <laughs> I was like sitting here since like 1.50. I was like, wait, do we have class? Because I didn't get an email, but then someone was like, just use the old link. I was like, oh. <laughs> Okay, that's all. Bye. <laughs> yeah. So save that link. Bookmark that link. We'll use it every week. Wait, did I even send? Did I? Did anybody get an email from me? I think I sent it. I never sent it. That's probably where people are right now. That's where Ben is right now. I'm just going to send it real be quick. In, uh, Chris's class, so. That's true, Ben and Gavin, but not Jared. No, I didn't participate today. Okay. Once they came out with those grades, it's pass fail, you know. <laughs> Amen. I haven't done that in this class. Mm, it's not your choice anymore. Yeah. <laughs> you don't I still try in your class, though. Mm, thanks. Okay. When did that when when did that email get sent? Like an hour ago. Oh really? <laughs> oh, is it from Shane Reese? Yeah, yeah good old Shane. Oh. <laughs> there it is. Okay. Wow, you can choose. If I give you if I give you a C minus, you can choose whether to take the pass or fail. Yeah. Hmm. It will not affect your GPA. Those of you who are slavishly keeping your GPA up. Well, that's good. We're just throwing everything out the window now. Everything's out mm. the window. Senior year. <laughs> <laughs> We're going to. We're going to continue to make the class as rigorous and as normal as possible, despite the fact that C's get degrees now. Okay. Uh, what about pass fail, Luke? Oh, you know, is it actually pass fail? Uh, evidently, students have the choice. If, if they don't like the way their grade's going, if they don't like the grade that I give, evidently, we still give grades. But if they want to take the pass or fail rather than the grade, they can, according oh. to Shane Reese. Thanks, Shane. 
Um, I'll have to, yeah, just I'll talk about that with my next call. But, yeah. Yeah, check your email. I just, I didn't see it, but it just came through. Yeah, I don't think I've got it. At 138 in my email. All right, who spoke up first? Was it Morgan? You want to show us your third one? Um, if I can figure out how. It's pretty easy. Hey, uh, guess what? Last time. When oh. I can, when you're screen sharing, I can request permission to control your screen. And if you grant it, I can like control your screen and show you. <laughs> Yeah, basically I can take over your computer if you grant me access. Maybe we'll test it on Morgan. Uh, we'll see. Just make sure when you go to share screen, you check the play computer audio checkbox at the bottom left. Uh, okay. Dom, you're touching your face. You're not uh, doing the five things. <laughs> I, I just oh, wash my hands. And then reopen. Yeah, go ahead. Is that a go gurt, Jared? It's applesauce. You can't hear him. Go, go, squeeze. It's a go, go, it's a go, squeeze. go, go, squeeze. Okay, yes. Strawberry. Whoa. <laughs> Blended up strawberries in a pouch? What year is it? It's delicious. Are you freelancing for NASA? <laughs> Astronaut food? We went and interviewed with uh, Thread Wallets today. Oh, did you? I just said I was, they have an office. They said I wasn't skateboardy enough. <laughs> and I don't know what it's going to take. <laughs> I, I'm going to agree with them. Yeah. You don't think he's skateboardy enough, Luke? I'm agreeing with um, you, actually, is what I oh. mean. Yeah, I, I misspoke. Like, you, I, don't, I don't know what they want. <laughs> I was like, I, just because I don't skateboard doesn't mean I don't fit the vibe. So... <laughs> Did I was like, I have a pair of Heelys. <laughs> <laughs> That's great. Yeah. How many times I don't know did you say to them? Did, how many times did you use the word bra in the interview? <laughs> well, I walked in, I was like, I saw, dude. And he was like, oh, hey. And then I was like, dude, let's go get some brewskis after this. And he was like, no. And I was like, okay. <laughs> that was your interview? Yeah, it was, it was a tough challenge. <laughs> rough. All right, Morgan, how's it going? Okay, I think I figured it out. Okay. Okay. Can you hear me? Yeah. I can hear you, yes. Okay. Are you trying to torture my old eyes with that text at the end, Morgan? Yeah, young people only. <laughs> like a 3% cost contrast ratio. Actually, with the uh, psychedelic posters in the 60s, that was like one thing that people would talk about was like, old people shouldn't be able to read this because like the text is wrong. <laughs> oh, yeah. Very nice grass phone. Gracias for showing us that, Morgan. Yep. Gracias! Yay. So, 
can the letters bounce around more in the little screen nook? Um, they probably could, but considering I did that in Octane and I'm in California Ooh. now, they cannot. Uh oh. You don't have any Windows machines in your house? They're kind of old. <laughs> they might still work. Ben is using Octane at his house on his old Windows machine. Oh. Just saying. Yeah, it looks, the grass is very grassy. Nice work on that texture. Okay, let's, uh, so that, that's a nice series, Morgan. I think uh, you should probably, if you post those on your portfolio, I would definitely show them together and individually. Yeah, I will do that. Cool, who else said they finished their third one? All right. Oh, Beth did. Beth is ready to present. Um, not my third one, my first one. Okay. <laughs> and my only one. <laughs> Sorry. The other ones are rendering. As we mm. speak. We. Oh. Brent, did you see the video that's going viral of the Zoom? Whatever of that girl who didn't know how to use it and she thought no one could see her <laughs> no oh no <laughs> oh did she go to the bathroom yes <laughs> yeah <laughs> i was just reading a headline about it and i haven't watched it yet <laughs> oh my gosh Wait, is there anything special that i need to do to get the sound to work it's so bad when you go to the Everyone's share playing. screen that's good that's oh, good can you hear me can you hear me now i can hear you brent <laughs> If that counts for something. It totally does. Another group pick. Four every month. Oh. Oh, now you're alive again, Beth. Can you hear us? There we go. Yeah, I can hear you now. Do I just yeah, so do screen share and it will do sound too? When you go to the screen, uh, share screen dialogue, you have to choose which window. And uh -huh. then you also have to click in the bottom left, share computer audio. Oh, very good. Okay. And there's another checkbox that's like uh, optimized for video playback or whatever. You might want to check that too. Okay. There we go. And you can just see. Can you see my whole screen? No. Just this. Sorry, this is just weird. Oh, well, Not surprise. <laughs> Very it dreamy. Looks so good. Wow. Thank you. I like the music. Thank you. I that, appreciate it. That music works well. So oh, are you Beth, an octane? Are you an octane user as well, Beth? No. Wow. Just um, Yeah. Took maybe 15 hours until it yeah. just stops and it didn't even finish, so. <laughs> it stopped rendering. But it got yeah, that, it was good. It looks delicious. It's all, uh, are, are those meta balls we're dealing with there? Mm -hmm. Those organic forms? Yep. Yeah, it's very conducive to the, the accompanying music. What do you have, what do you have planned for your remaining two? Um, so the other, the other two, I have a sound effector for one that has, I think you've kind of seen it, but there's a sound effector and it's just moving to the beat of uh, music and it's like similar shapes and similar color palette. Um, and then the other one is just like one big blob moving. I don't know if that even makes sense. <laughs> I'm imagining it in my head and it sounds good. Mm -hmm. Anyways, yeah. I 
think if I could make a typographic suggestion on your poster, I think so. Was your type in 3D as well? Was it dimensional also, or was it flat? No, it was flat. I think you could scale it down a bit. I mean, I'm just remembering what I saw in the past. I think the text could be a little smaller. Anybody else have suggestions as to how Beth could improve before you build out the series, the triptych, the trilogy? Yeah, I think the text could be a little smaller and just let those meta balls speak. Maybe not slender bodies, but certainly the tour text could be smaller and electric forest. Oh yeah, if you'd like more contrast and scale. Yeah. Cool. I could ease, I don't know why this keeps coming to my head, but I can easily see you adding some kind of, like, you know, when you see an old projector. The pros. Uh-oh. Oh, now it's back. Oh, okay. What came to your head? To, what? You might have to repeat what you said, Luke. <laughs> oh, uh, Sorry. Just like, you know, when you see an old projector with RGB, like the RGB lights that combine to make like the correct color, but like sometimes they'll get separated. So there's some like offset. So there's like kind of a red tinge on one side and a green on the other. Uh -huh. I don't know if that makes sense. Uh, yeah. I, I don't know. Like I could just see like, I think you're really close with this stuff. And maybe this is something you could even just apply in After Effects or something without rendering. I, I could just, it almost looks like it's almost there already. Um, let me, are you just care if I show you what I'm talking about real fast? Yeah. Are you talking about chromatic aberration, Luke? Yes. Thank you, Brent. Yeah, that's, separation of the color channels. That's a good suggestion. Um, whoops. Uh, let me see. And I, I, I just, this is obviously a little bit off the wall, maybe based on um, like this is just kind of out of nowhere. But You're frozen um, again. I'm frozen. Check yourself, Beth. Oh, I blame Mr. Beth's Beth. internet connection. Um, Beth's gone. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Well, that's chromatic that's okay. aberration. I, I, I don't even think it has to look like this, but there's just some kind of like, I, I guess what I'm trying to say is I think the lighting could be like 5% cooler and it's already there. It would just be like a little tweak to like, and this is like an example of like something you could do, but that's not even here. So I'm going to stop talking about it. <laughs> Hmm, she's still not back. All right. Yeah, I'm impressed that she was able to do that inside standard render, but yeah, it looks yeah. awesome. some more edge. Uh, lighting, it's all about lighting. It always comes back to lighting, doesn't it? Little chromatic aberration. Hmm, like, well. Go ahead. What were you going to say, Brent? I was going to say, while we wait for Beth to return, hopefully she's okay. Hopefully she's not stuck in a ditch somewhere. <laughs> Beth said move. my Wi-Fi just quit. Tell them uh -oh. I'm sorry. I'm coming back. Okay. Maybe someone else could present in the meantime. Or we could just fulfill Brenna's request and take a screenshot. Well, when I everyone's here yet, no. Like a thing where our arms look like one long wavy <laughs> line. So, you know what's weird uh, is we all have a different arrangement of our thumbnails. I noticed uh, in the screenshot that did you send it out, Brenna? Yeah. I noticed that I wasn't in the same spot in the one you sent than on my screen. So it's like we they all have to be very modular. Whatever we do, it has to. You never know who's going to end up next to you. Yeah, like right right now, Luke is to the right of me. Oh yeah, see, oh. Brenna is between me and Brent right now. What? Well, we should definitely do a photo of all of us really close to the camera. <laughs> <laughs> Done. Hi, Ben. 
<laughs> oh, hey, Brent. Everyone's coming. Beth's back. Oh, great. Ah, uh, I'm sorry. There you are. <laughs> yeah, Jared, you're really close. Um. <laughs> Cool. So Luke made all these really helpful comments while you were gone, Beth. What comments? I, I can't say them again. I'm too tired. <laughs> they were really helpful. Though. They were so helpful. Beth's frozen again. <laughs> uh oh. Well, she's frozen with a motion blurred hand in front of her face. <laughs> Maybe she's just become an energy being. She's like, oh, that's the most likely, <laughs> the most likely solution. Well, how about Jared emailed me his third when at Bowling League? Yeah, it's, Maybe. it's not done. It's more like just to give you an idea of what I'm going to do. Okay. Maybe what I'll do is I will share that and we'll see if Beth. <laughs> <laughs> wow, Ben, you look like law enforcement. Hey, <laughs> law enforcement. <laughs> Officer Law. Yeah. <laughs> the long arm of the law is coming to get you. Yelling yeah, some jokes of my name. Yeah, it's probably not the first time, is it, Ben? No. <laughs> it could be worse. <laughs> Okay, I'm going to share my quick time. Columbus Circle, I love you like the 16. And I don't mean that as a. Is this a bubble machine, Jared? It is a bubble machine. These little cannons are going to be shooting out the bubbles. Amazing. Yeah. I'm really excited about that. Yeah, yeah I'm excited to see it. So that's you had, all I've got. Okay. You had uh, vertical text on your other ones? When I'd cut? Yeah. It was along the side. Yeah, and this, on the side. And this one is primarily typographic. I'm trying to remember your other two, but they didn't have like large WBL, did they? No, they didn't have any okay. letters like that. Yeah. Okay. So we talked about doing maybe a. So this is your typographic one. It's not I, very typographic. I would, <laughs> yeah, it's sort of like 50 50. And right now, I think the stroked text is competing a little bit in size with the WBL, the, mm -hmm. the slick chocolate letters or whatever. Copper? Are they copper? They were supposed to be the same orange as the other ones, and somehow they turned out brown, but I didn't have enough time to change it, so I just threw it in there. Okay. Yeah, I mean, it looks maybe like balloons. Balloons? Yeah. It, it do look very shiny and, and rubbery, it's true. I would just uh, watch the scale. I would maybe WBL takes priority on this one and the stroked text. I think you could do something a little bit different. I mean, it's already different because this one's primarily typographic and the other one's image based, but um, you might consider whether you need the stroked one on this one because mm -hmm. there is a little bit of competition there between the sizes. Yeah. Cool. But yes, it's looking promising, just as your other ones. Sweet. Beth says her Wi-Fi is terrible and her hotspot is the worst. She's going to go try to go somewhere else. <laughs> so yes, we are recording this, so I can post it for everybody. Not that that's an excuse for you to miss class, but. 
Okay, uh, Ben or Gavin or anyone else, would you like to show us a thing? I don't have anything still. A motion poster related thing. Uh, working on it. Okay. Uh, Octing is fun. <laughs> yeah, it is. It is so What's much that, faster. <laughs> I'm still working on the third, but I, I have something fun that I would like to show you, but it has nothing to do with motion posters. <laughs> well, if it's, oh. it's, it is three, it is 3D. Okay, go ahead and show us. And then Dom, what were you going to say? <laughs> uh, sorry, I finished my third one, but I don't, my... Uh, Cinema 4D took like two days to render it, and it's so simple, so I don't want to touch it, but it's done, but it's awful. <laughs> That's it. Ooh, Gavin. Really? Nice phones. Thanks. You did all of that? I did, I did parts of it. And then oh. um, someone that works with my brother, Nick Dixon, he did the rest of it. Cool. How long did it take you to physically manufacture the small ceramic white letters and put them in 3D space? Not, not that long. <laughs> How did you hide the, the fishing line that they were being suspended by? <laughs> nice work Gavin that seems like a fun job yeah I know it's super fun I mean it makes me want to do stuff like this forever <laughs> forever <laughs> maybe for the photo that we take as a class it's all just a uh, sunglasses <laughs> Luckily, I had a pair of shades right here in my office. Is there like a like a filter that we can put on, like a like a you know, like a Snapchat thing? For Zoom? I don't know. Do you have stuff like that? There's just backgrounds. You can change your background, Ben. <clears throat> We can make like a rainbow. Like that? <laughs> it doesn't even let me put backgrounds on. What? Yeah. How do you do Are that? You... Like go to, is it like customization? Yes. It is all under, by the stop video button, that little up, up pointing arrow. Brenna, these backgrounds aren't for you. <laughs> no! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, hey, where is it? Go to choose virtual background and that pop up by stop video. Stop video. Oh, there it is. Oh. <laughs> Where's the virtual background? You have to add yourself. They don't have like. No, there's you. There are some built in, aren't they not? Are they not? <laughs> sure? Are you? Wait, maybe if I close my blinds? <laughs> no. no, you're still a ghost, Brenna. Oh my, oh, my hands! Oh my ring, though. Wow. Wait, Jared, <laughs> how did you how did you do that? Because that's kind of what's happening to Brenna. What on earth? I kept. No, you don't have. I don't have I, any. I, I have a green screen. Whoa. Oh, Brenna! <gasps> Un uncheck. I have a green screen. <laughs> In your settings. Oh, it doesn't let me uncheck it. <laughs> no, it's, you it's have to have a green screen. Check. It says to use it. I don't have a good enough processor. So I can't turn it off. <laughs> that so is what's happening. Yeah, this is me as a baby. 
So this is kind of like a weird video art piece. <laughs> I come out from the forest. Whoa. <laughs> that's exactly what's happening to Brenna is the green screen. That's you might have to do it in browser, Brenna. In your uh, browser <laughs> Oh my teeth. <laughs> okay. So uh what more do we need to discuss on MoPos? I I have been thinking about a more liberal European style grading policy. That's actually not accurate. In Europe, school is way harder. I have been thinking about a more liberal grading policy. Like we still have deadlines, but you actually have until the end of the semester to turn everything in. But the, the pass fail thing has sort of negated all that. Hey, cool, Ben. Thanks. So you should all finish three motion posters um, and maybe on the final screening the final virtual varsity screening uh, we, we watch everything because we need to move on to packaging and our information graphic loops okay are we ready to shift gears rachel says something in the chat it's taking five ever to render and export. Okay, well, when, it, when it's done, send something up in the chat and we will pause. By the way, oh, um, Beth isn't here. Remember when Beth had like a little coffee cup by her name last class? And I was just like, hey, cool, a coffee cup. Turns out that means she wants to take a break. How did you That's do that? Like, Beth always has that on. Is it always on? No, Maybe just... she doesn't know it's on. But I was reading it. What those? What those little symbols? If you look, can you see the participants list on your screen? Yeah. So the at the bottom it says yes, no, go slower, go faster, and then there's a more button. Under more, there's a coffee cup, and that's how you signal that I would like to take a break. <laughs> Wait, wait, you can also, wait. There's also an applaud button. I can raise my hand. How do you do that? And I can lower it. That's funny. See, Rachel just gave it a thumbs up. Huh. Wait, so I can uh, unmute people from here? Oh, no, I can't. No, nah, it doesn't work. I thought that I could since I'm the host, but not even I can. No power. Oh. JK, I just muted Ben. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> okay, I do have the power. <laughs> okay, I want to talk to you about what you plan on doing for your packaging. And I think that's something you could share with the class as well. And I'm gonna show you some examples of past packaging assignments. Where's the coffee cup? Oh, there it is. It's under more. I oh, found it. Okay. <laughs> okay. I think, do I dare show you this one? Uh, someone from my 380 class an hour ago is waiting for me in a room to get online. What? <laughs> I had a student this semester when I was sick. He didn't get my email and he waited outside of our class for all four hours. <laughs> No. What? I was like, never do that again. <laughs> too, too much. Too much. Um, I, but no, I, 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 I just said there will never be a time where I will not let you into class if I'm there. 
You didn't look at, like, you didn't send me an email? No, I did send it. He didn't see it. <laughs> I just felt bad for him. I was like, no. Well, yeah. you did your part. That's, that's sad. Here, let me see if I can, if I share this finder window with you, can mm -hmm. I? I'm going to put that over there. Can I just, uh, can you guys see this? Can you see my quick view? Yeah. yeah. So this is, this is actually Henry Lee, uh, an industrial design student, and he designed a new uh, prescription bottle. And he animated how the lid works. That's really cool, actually. Three different sizes. So I know we talked about just doing one bottle, but this is a good example of how if you design one bottle, you can easily adapt it to three or more. 50. 50, well, slightly differing. Yeah, we, maybe this is an older version. We talked about how the Verdana isn't the best choice for label type. Oh, you mean a typeface? Yes. Mm. Verdana was designed for the screen, Ikea. <laughs> Ooh. This is fun. <clears throat> Hi, I'm a pill bottle. Blah. <laughs> General Fault Pharmacy. That's a, that's a good name. It's really cute color. Cute. Very cute. Let's see. What did Matt Benfell do? <clears throat> tuna. Cans of tuna. Not enough polygons on the corners, but uh, I appreciated the... <laughs> That's the design, Brent. <laughs> you think that was on purpose? Yes. <laughs> it's, matching the, it's matching the typeface. It's like cringy. Sure typeface is made out of straight lines as well. This is Maddie White. Bottles are a little, little thick. The water looks like wine. I mean, well, it's slightly tinted, like the blueberry is slightly blue, the orange is slightly orange, and the lemon and lime is slightly yellow. Cool. If you know what I mean. There's Abby's, what is this, high-end sparkling lemonade? I think that was in like a, like a, like a, like an award thing before, right? Seen before. Delheim, you've seen these before? Yeah. They got into graphics. Yeah. Oh, good job, Abby. I haven't looked at that yet. What did MJ do? MJ did clay and copper. That's dope. I want mm -hmm. that. Sustainable packaging. I don't love the gray background. Yeah. Staging is super important, dudes. Let's look at brands. Skit, skit, no. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's the cost of taking the class twice. <laughs> I'll take it a third time and you'll all be sorry. <laughs> hey. <laughs> See, look, Bram made a little pedestal. Cute. Oh, that's he cute. Asked he asked Jason Lanigan down in the gallery to make this and then photographed it. That's what the inside of my shower looks like. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> it's a big shower. It's like eight feet wide. Cute. Sage did cheese balls, cheese. I remember. <laughs> cheese. What did Todd do? Todd did fuse. See, Todd's bottle is very frosted and the type is clear glass. Cool. That's what I need to know how to do. Just remind me of a, what's her name, Laura's. Not yeah. Good. Yeah. Laura did a perfume, right? Yeah, but perfume with like the frosted and then yeah. there's like the clear. Was it all frosted except for the letters or something? I think so, yeah. Oops. Milk. 
Ainsley's milk cartons. So it can be any kind of package. Let's see, did anybody do a good job <laughs> in 2018? Oh, I thought you meant like that. That is so sad. <laughs> Just thinking out loud here. Something worthy of showing future generations is, you know, what we're talking about. Packaging winter 18. Oh, Dallin's was good. Ikire, Ikire Jones, that was pretty good. All right, I will show you these. See, that's not what I, that one's, look at that rope. Wow. wow. Cropped for me. Yeah, we can only see the top of your screen. <laughs> oh, wow. The rope is like alive. It is, it's, it's like a snake. What about now, is it still cropped? <clears throat> no. Oops, I'm gonna have to do this. Ikira. Ikire. Ikire Jones. If you move over your um, your like preview screen a little bit, I think you should be good. Oh, I know it's, yeah. So it's only the width of my window. So if I make my window big. Whoa. Work? Yeah, whoa. Sweet. We're learning more about Zoom each and every day. Look at that box. That looks nice. Look That's at those cool. corners. Cropped too close on the side, so. <laughs> That's true. It's a good eye, Brenna. What did Emmy do? Emmy didn't quite finish the label of hers, but the packages themselves. A, B, C. A, B, and C. Which is actually a good idea for a packaging. Product. There's no, no mixing up A and B, right? Yep. One, two, three. ABC. Those are nice. Wow. Kahi did upscale Chanel. Whoa, look at those. So shiny. Look at those like reflected lights on the thing. It's like 10 of them. <laughs> yeah, a lot yeah. of lights. It's a whole row of lights. The HDRI. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I don't want to, it looks like it's been bitten. Uh, I have oh, like, like, is it kind of weird? Like when people like crack their like lipstick in like a commercial, it's kind of weird. <laughs> like it's like, ooh. Ian's is a chocolate. Yes, chocolate. Chocolate. The chocolate is a little bit rigid, not quite smooth that as chocolate should be, but the boxes look great. This is a good shot. I like that design too. Yeah, the design is excellent. The chocolate needs a little more attention. But... Yeah. Let's see, Tyler did like a motorcycle. This was in conjunction with his senior branding. Bye bye. Has Ben taking a call? Sorry, <laughs> I forgot to mute. Okay. Ben, mute I yourself. <laughs> I don't know why I only have one ibuprofen bottle by Zoe. Okay, that was a that was an animation student that showed up maybe three times all semester. Okay. So, let's hear it. What are you planning on doing? And did I see Beth was back? Don't she gone? 
Well, we're recording this, so don't say anything bad about it, okay? Okay, I know what oh, I'm I doing for my know. packaging project. Okay, uh, what's that, Deb? Um, Brent, you probably saw me. It was those wine bottles for my pack for that branding project that I did for portfolio yes. reviews. Uh -huh. So I'm gonna do those. Okay. Excellent. What was the what was the name? What's the Cayman Estate Wines, but it's just Cayman Wines. Let's see, I don't know who raised their hand. Okay, the first one to put the little hand next to their name in the list gets to go. <laughs> Wait, you can do that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, I don't know. Oh, it looks like Ben <laughs> Ben, and Dom. Oh, I, I was just trying, but um, Dom mm -hmm. can go first. Yeah. Dom, mm -hmm. then Brenna. Um, I'm going to do Dr. Bronner's soap, conditioner, all that. Dr. Bronner's. I'm not a I'm not a Dr. Bronner's user. What's Maybe what's either. the gist? <laughs> <laughs> um, like spars of soap, conditioner, shampoo, all that. Is it but meant I'm gonna to make be... it the elite package? Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. It's not, it's pretty iconic right now where it's got like just, just a bunch text of text blocks on text blocks yeah. and it's all like really interesting spiritual chant yeah writing but i rebranded it for branding can i see something <laughs> yeah show us show us what you got dom so far uh maybe next time okay <laughs> it's on my website but it's not like it's not like done it's like a work in progress okay, okay. socially and environmentally responsible products <laughs> Oh yes, I remember this from your portfolio. Yeah. Has tons of type on it, on the existing brand. Yeah, I took off a lot of it. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Okay, that sounds good. Dom, anything else before we allow Brenna to present? Nope, thank you. Okay, thank you. Brenna, then Ben. Okay, do you want me to show you or? The show and tell, tell us, okay. please. Um, oh, share screen. There it is. All right. Can we see? Yeah. I can see your finder. Files. So, whoa, whoa. All right. So, there are these bottles. It's a sparkling water company from, they, get their water from Asarasi. maple trees, Asarasi. So maple trees. Maple trees, yep. So when companies make maple syrup, they throw out most of the, what is it called? The water that's used and it's pure water. So they decided to make it into a company. What, does it taste like syrup? No, <laughs> well they flavor it too, so. So this is what my mock-up I have right now for it, but um, it's the only angle I have. And plus I have, my connection is unstable, it just told me. Um, but basically the glass is frosted with these patterns on it, but I also have a label that's on the bottom and the top, but I can't show it. So that's what I'm going to try and figure out, 740. That's actually really easy. Great. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You just stack yep. the materials and you put like an alpha channel on to make tell it where to cut it out to show the material under it. Does that make sense? Cool. Sounds yeah. like we should do a demo of that, Luke. Like sure. yeah, yeah. On Wednesday, a material stacking demo. Yeah. So those are my my bottles. Very good. So Colton had a question. Oh, did you get your question answered? You know, when you have a question like that, it's a good question. It would benefit everybody. Feel free to speak. Because I, I didn't notice until right now. Okay. Product brand first or cho choose the type of package. Yeah, I, I think product and brand first, Colton. Okay. Milk Thank you for your help, Luke. 
Okay. And Jared. Yeah. <laughs> Especially Jared. <laughs> I love that on Amazon when you're reading reviews for something and like four people respond. I haven't bought this. I have no clue. <laughs> <laughs> Why? Why did you? It's like when you ask someone for a piece of gum and they go, I have it in my car. <laughs> Not helpful. Okay, Ben and then Rachel's hand is raised. Um, so I have, is it, has, it has to be a bottle, right? No, it can be any product container. It could be a okay. carton, a bottle, um, a box. I have two things I've worked on before and probably want to extend on that. You want to see? Uh, yeah. Yeah. You've, I have seen, but I don't know if everyone else has. Here, where is it? Let's see. One second. I'm going to pull up the thingy. This been... <clears throat> It's been a little bit different since last time you see it, so. It's like when you try to find something, you can't find it. Mm -hmm. At least your background's working really well. Like your, uh, your outline is very strong. Whoa, 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 whoa. What happened? Me, sorry. Let's see. That's awkward. I'm so sorry. Staring at me. Um, Who's going to invent headphones that don't make your ears sweaty? <laughs> or that like go into your ear canal? Earbuds. <laughs> yeah, I mean, but buds. Buds don't have the noise cancer. Do you see it? There no. we go. Mm -hmm. Well, so th this one is like a mail company that I'm doing in my packaging class. Um, and then that, let's see, that's the bottle. What the? Um, of it. <laughs> you're done? Yeah, you're done. Incred incredulity. No, I need, still need to, like, put something on it, the name of the company on it. Yeah, you had um, some black and white graphics, didn't you, Ben? Yeah, mm -hmm. and then now, this is the there you box go. for it. Cool. Okay, well, he's done. I told Ben, since he's already done packaging, he has to turn in his mopos really soon. Oh. <laughs> Uh, so that's my first idea, and then like, oh yeah, that's a cap of it. Oh, that's the soap that I'm doing. What the? He's got four or five. We just have to tell him which one we think is the best. Um, but yeah. Wow. But yeah, so it just should just yeah. I, I'm gonna extend it a little bit more, but that's what I'm gonna do. They both look great. You're good. Yeah. <laughs> um, did you use Octane, Ben? Yeah, those are Octane. So it's yeah. a lot faster. Yeah. The lighting is, yeah, you can tell. The lighting is fantastic. Yeah. Good staging. Thank you. All right, okay. How do I stop this? Stop screen share. <laughs> no, Deb, everyone should not stop being good. Everyone should all be good at the same time. Wait, wait, stop sharing. Okay, good. I'm done. Thank you. Nice, Ben. Sorry, what I meant. Let's see, where's my. What I meant to say is. Clap. Uh, Rachel, and then Morgan. Okay, hi. Um, how do I screen share? 
bottom, bottom settings. Right next to the purchase bins, there's a little green button that says share screen. Oh. I like your hairstyle, Brenna. What? I like your hairstyle. Thank you. <laughs> does, it re does it remind you of Bjork, Ben? It looks like it's remind me of like that um, character in uh, Street Fighter. <laughs> Would I be flattered? Brenna is a hardcore gamer. <laughs> flattered. Right? Yeah. Ooh. Okay. Ooh. Is this showing? Yeah. Sure is. Cool. We're looking at your browser. Yeah. So this is a labeling project I did a long time ago. And I think it would be cool to make a different kind of soy sauce bottle. One that looks more like a soy sauce bottle with like the top that's like spouted kind of. That yeah. Makes sense. And then so maybe these... do. Sorry. Oh, go ahead. Go ahead. And then maybe do like frosted glass design or something with it. Dope. Uh, uh, this is just a 2D comp. This is like a Photoshop comp that you're showing us. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. See, you could, yeah, not only show us like the function of the bottle, mm -hmm. but if you did want to make any changes to the actual industrial design, because is this, where did this bottle shape come from? Did you find it? yeah it's supposed like to be found... like gin or alcohol or something like okay yeah i mean if you it looks a bit wide to me like so mm -hmm. i would say if there's anything about it you don't like you could definitely correct it in modeling and but like the packaging and the idea uh, is fantastic and then you could uh cool. show us how it works yeah good job mm, cool yeah approved yeah. maru Toku? Is that what it was called? Yeah. <laughs> what does that mean? Seaweed. On What's it. that, Ben? It says seaweed on it. Seaweed, okay. It's like uh, Morgan. Seaweed. Morgan is next. Um, so I did. That's back. I did this packaging project. It's. um essential oils in like skincare and so I just want to expand it. What's that noise? Ah. Mommy. Can you hear me? Oh I can hear you. Yeah. Can you like uh make it bigger? I want to see their words on that Morgan. <laughs> bigger. Big there we go. Aura Katia. Like the gradients. Thanks. Quite so elegant. I never did like the dropper bottles for this brand like I wanted to, so that's probably what I'll mostly do. Okay. I was gonna say these mock-ups are quite nice, Morgan. What are you gonna do to <laughs> prove upon it? No, oh, yeah, so I just want to expand it. <clears throat> okay. That's great. Beautiful. See. Colton, you still figuring it out? Which what, what do you want to do? Uh, yeah, I think I need a little bit more time. It's good to see what everyone else has done. Mm -hmm. um, to do like see different types of branding and stuff. Um, but yeah, I think I need a little bit more time to like brainstorm and figure it out. Okay. Uh, Bram, Bram Link at gmail.com um i'm working on uh packaging for salt company for adrian's uh 3d class okay but and it's just gonna be like cardboard tube salt containers um so i think that'll be pretty easy <laughs> i'm just concerned if i wanted to show like the actual salt crystals how that would work out on my computer Um, it's like cardboard, cardboard steak, cardboard tube. Yeah, you know how like salt shakers are sometimes made out of like the molten or um, what is it, Morton salt tube? Mm -hmm. 
Yeah, but yours so would be it'll like, be like that, just more more contemporary style too. Mm -hmm. Unwrapped, like raw craft cardboard. Or, uh, yeah, pretty much. Cool. So like sustainable packaging is what the goal mm -hmm. is here. Yeah. Okay. No plastic moving parts. No plastic. What about metal? Metal sustainable, right? I sure hope so. <laughs> yeah, I haven't um, started sketching out the tube yet. I've just working, been working on the label for Adrian's class. Okay. There are ways to achieve salt. Who did, let's see, Haley Ord, Bryson did salt. It was pretty chunky. Is this chunky salt? Is it like sea salt or is it regular fine yeah, salt? Yeah, sea salt. Okay, yeah, I think you can do it even without octane. With, okay. you could do it either with Voronoi fracture, if you remember that day when we blew things up, or I think you could do it with particles with a few different polygon shapes that you just repeat with a cloner, so it's possible. Okay. Yeah, I can we'll just talk take about that. Yeah, yeah. I made some salsa once that in a way that might help too. Like I just I used a displacement map. And since it was just like not a displacement map, I used a displacement channel. Mm. And because it was a still image, it didn't like destroy my computer. <laughs> but uh like I can show it to you if you want. Yeah. You, can tell you displaced me. salsa? Yeah, I'll show you. Oh, is it like the is that like the plane? Yeah, it's that one. So cool. Thanks, bro. You've seen it, Ben? Yeah, it's like the iconic video of Luke. Flying <laughs> tortilla chips. <laughs> wait, wait, maybe I've seen it. Um Let's see. Let's see. Share my whole screen. Did you make that in Cinema 40? This? Yeah. Yeah, it was all cinema. Um, that. So I don't know. Can you guys see that? Yeah. Uh huh. You have to play the whole thing now. <laughs> no, it's so bad. <laughs> <laughs> the chips look great. Those tomatoes look fantastic. And I want a still of those tomatoes to put on my wall. I think if I had more time, I would have put like some imperfections on them, you know? Mm -hmm. but I think we don't want that. <laughs> no imperfections. <laughs> ben does not like imperfections. I'm just kidding. <laughs> anyway, I was wondering if like you had like a salt, like a texture of a bunch of salt on a tray and you just mm -hmm. kind of play. That looks really it. real. Did you use like a displacement map with like a glossy? Yeah, it's a real picture of salsa with the displacement map and some bump and some reflection on it. Mm. Oh. Looks delicious. So I could use a picture of salt and just use yeah. like a similar. Yeah, I, I can guarantee you there's some displacement texture for uh, sugar or salt out there, Bram. I, and especially sea salt with large chunks. Cool. What was that for, Luke? That was nice. Oh, in a while back, like a, towards the beginning of grad school, I had to make, uh, it was this, I took a cinema class, a cinema 40 class, and we had to make a project where we had a realistic object inside a fantasy world. And so I made a nacho chip flying in a little poly world and it landed in a volcano and the volcano turned into a bowl of salt. So. Beautiful. Thanks. Very nice. Okay, good. Uh, Jared, what are you thinking? Uh, much like my response to Colton, I still have no clue. <laughs> um, I've been looking up some ideas and I have no idea. Well, um, we're all going to assign you something. Okay. Let's see. Either adult diapers 
or <laughs> what else? Can I have suggestions? Hot dogs. Hot dog hot packaging. <laughs> <laughs> like a single hot, hot dog? <laughs> like go dog. Go 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 dog. <laughs> go go dog squeeze. It's not like just a slim gym. I mean, well, hot, hot dog packaging. Package hot dog. How? In all seriousness, hot dog packaging is problematic because once they're opened, all the juice just gets everywhere. True. Solve the world problem. <laughs> I mean, you, you just opened up its embryo, so I mean. Ew. <laughs> Gross. <laughs> uh, yeah. like, like, like a jars of hot dog, like a pickles. Ew. <laughs> <laughs> so they're always. I guess they are just floating in liquid anyway, just not that much. Would it be that hard to put like a Ziploc zipper be on like Vienna hot sausage. dog bag? I think some of them already have the zipper on them. Okay. Yeah. But Vienna sausage is like hot dogs in a jar, like pickles. Oh. Vienna sausages, though, you can just like crush them. They're just like paste, barely taking the form of a small hot dog. <laughs> <laughs> or, or it could be like a little package that like, it could be like, like a Ziploc bag, it's got a zipper and it already looks like a little hot dog and you unzip it and then inside is your hot dog for the day. <laughs> for some reason, the fact that it's horizontal just makes it even crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Might be cool. You should do it. I have no clue I, what I'll do. I think Jared should do a tin of something. A tin of skate wax for waxing curbs. The, the horizontal, <laughs> sorry to go back, but the horizontal hot dog package reminds me of like a pencil pouch with hot dogs. <laughs> oh, yeah. A literal zipper. <laughs> yeah, there it is. Like that. I'm <laughs> hungry, dudes. I'm going to pull up my Kotopaxi dog holder. <laughs> uh, uh, like a year ago, I had huge party with a bunch of friends where all we did was dance to Nickelback and there was just raw hot dogs and people just came and danced with the hot dogs and you'd be surprised there was over a hundred people that showed up to this party just because there was it was just so weird <laughs> people like weird stuff sometimes mm -hmm. it's true too <sighs> much Market. Okay, Jared, consider yourself warned that you need to pick something really soon. Okay. I'll pick it tonight and I'll email it to you. Okay, awesome. Dom, did you already go? Yeah, you showed us yours. Rachel, you already went. Gavin. Is he there? Oh no, I think he's, he's there. He's technically. He's, he's just text. But he's gaining the courage. <laughs> what should I say? We're losing everybody. Yeah, people are dropping off oh. flies. Gavin, yeah, we can't hear you. <laughs> we can't hear you, Gavin. We could before. Wait. Did we ever hear him talk, or has he just been in the chat the whole time? We he did we did he show us the thingy. Oh yeah. If you're hooked up to a second screen, sometimes and your laptop is closed. I don't know if that's the case, but sometimes uh, it can still be taking the video. Ah, uh, there we go. Oh, there we go. There you go. What was it, Gavin? All right. Second screen thing. Yes. Mm -hmm. Good, job, Good one, Luke. Okay. Right so I am. Looking at brands and products, right? Yes. <laughs> Go on. Um, yes. <laughs> I was looking. <laughs> there's, uh, share. Does that work? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Sweet. All right. So I'm looking at the product red 
like a camera and I think it could be kind of fun because the product red like it'd be with that box and the box would be like red and white and then the other one I was looking at is the red Komodo is a camera that's supposed to come out this year so there's no packaging for it yet and it's just a modular camera and so if it comes in like a camera kit it comes with batteries your memory modules and your lens and all that stuff and so mm. i thought that could also be kind of fun in terms of like how things fit in a box or if it's the box is the carrying case or however that might be and it's it's a high-end camera so it has to be a little you know nicer you have why to are they making a the camera first <laughs> yeah so why are they uh why are they making a 6k is it like low copies is it low cost like because they already have an 8k right yeah so they have the dcm 2 and 3 series which is what they shoot like most hollywood cinema films so it's like the helium the monstro and yeah. the epic but the komodo is four by four and it's ultra mm. portable so they're they actually just shot like the hard rock cafe commercial on it they shot they're shooting matrix on it and then in one of the scenes they had it with like a like a lens which is like eight grand for one cinema lens mm -hmm. and they put that right next to like some action and uh they're blowing stuff up in uh san francisco and they melted the whole camera <laughs> and and the light post that was on it but the oh. memory was still intact so the idea of like this camera is like it's an affordable camera for people who want to shoot red. Um, and it's also super durable, so you could kind of thrash it around. Okay. And that, footage. That, that's a really interesting packaging project. It might be pretty complex for this reduced uh, packaging assignment. What was the other one you, that you for, showed us first? Uh, uh, product red. Yeah. Like a you might want to go, despite the fact that the combo of Johnny Ive and Mark Newson is probably the most insufferable smug duo of designers I could ever imagine. <laughs> I think that one is probably a better, better idea. I think you could accomplish. You could just keep it simpler. Okay. And it's a great looking camera. I mean, there's no doubt about it. Those, Mark Newson, at least, is a great industrial designer. So is Johnny Ive, let's be honest. <laughs> So what do you guys think? Yeah, camera, I think the camera is like and better. I think you can put more effort into a simpler. I, I don't know. It just seems like the the red. You'd need lots of. You just need to be this super sturdy. Yeah. Anyway. Cool. Bath. Back. Hi, I'm back. Can you hear me? Hi. Yes, yeah. we can. Um, what are we talking about? <laughs> we need you to tell us what you plan on uh, designing for packaging. Oh, yeah. Is it working? Oh, I'm back. Okay. There you are. Um, so I was thinking about um, repackaging some uh, milk products that I had done. It's like a almond milk brand called uh, Three Trees and um, doing like milk bottles for that or um, packaging like some cheese, almond cheese. Did you say almond cheese? Yeah. It's real. <laughs> like vegan? Vegan cheese? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Uh, those all sound like doable choices. Which one are you leaning toward? Mm, I'm not sure. Yeah, probably the milk. Carton products. Probably do like a choice. glass bottle. Oh, mm -hmm. old style. Yeah, that's, I mean, if we're trying to keep things simple, and refine simplicity uh, that's that's probably a good call 
I think almond cheese is such like a niche product that I don't, I don't know if it would, I don't know. I think expectations sometimes are half the, the battle here and dairy is a little more known. Mm -hmm. So yeah, I, either way I think it would work, but milk is, is a great approach, great idea. Cool. Well, thanks. Cool. Thank you. Uh, who hasn't been able to go? Did everybody go? Okay. What's going on in Jared's room? I don't know. I think we're on the ground and Jared's looking down at us. Just can't get comfy. You know. <laughs> Tired of sitting in a chair. Cool. <laughs> um, all right. So we are it's up to you whether you want to set aside motion posters for the time being and start focusing full on your packaging. We have so little time for packaging. Um, it might be good to just put in a push, an effort on packaging, and then revisit your MOPOs if you're still trying to finish them. But let's see, I don't, where's my due date for packaging? Why are all my can you guys see due dates on Learning Suite? I don't see any due dates anymore. That could just be I'll look. an error. Learning Suite was down for me all day, so I haven't been able to see anything. Yeah, yeah. it's okay. It's back now. I can see it again. Oh, yeah. yeah. Right now, April Fool's Day is packaging deadline. Ha, uh, joke's on you. <laughs> Evidently, the joke is on me, according to Shane Reese. <laughs> so yeah, I would recommend putting in a push on uh, packaging. It's certainly those of you who are still deciding what to do, uh, figure that out and start sketching. Because yeah, that's coming right up. It's like 10 days away. Let's do it. I have you a could question. Borrow, borrow one of Ben's projects. Yes, Deb. Um, so should by Wednesday, should I just start modeling my bottles? And then are we just, did you say earlier that we were going to have sign up sheets that we could just zoom with you or Luke about specific questions or how are we doing? <clears throat> yeah, I well, I plan on I planned on doing that today for any additional individual help. But yeah, we'll definitely okay. do that. I do think we should do a materials of uh, sort of refresher slash new materials uh, demo on Wednesday okay. and then break up into groups. So yeah, we'll make okay. we'll make another schedule, sort of like we did last time with dual column signups, if Luke's on board with that. Mm -hmm. okay, okay, cool. Thanks. Modeling your bottles or bottling your models? <laughs> <laughs> okay, is it time for our family photo? <laughs> yeah, yeah, because we're gonna we're pretty much done with the uh, all togetherness. We're gonna break up into individuals now. Okay, Rachel and Gavin have to show mm -hmm. up. Unless what are we doing? We're doing a little picture. A oh, do we have to hold hands or are we just doing like, normal? Uh, we can do something different, or we can do the same thing. Uh, we we're should make a heart. This, I was thinking. Well, I definitely want one where we're all really close to the camera. We want to do that now. <laughs> Just our faces. Don't look at my mm -hmm. eyebrows. <laughs> okay. <laughs> One, two, three. Come on. <laughs> oh, great. I think I got it. That was not good. That was too close. <laughs> like your beer, Gavin. Oh. <laughs> Coming along. So what we call a Fu Manchu, because it doesn't actually go in all the way. <laughs> I'm right, guys, one too. You guys look really great. I'll send that later. <laughs> Wait, just pose. One, two. Where's Beth? <laughs> she's gone. Where'd she go? Beth got... Is she still here? Well, no, she's not. I don't know what's going on. One, two. <laughs> oh, I like Colton. Colton. Okay. Yeah. Colton, modern dance. <laughs> All right. I had to be quick on my feet for that. 
All right, let's. Are we adjourned? So how do we, we sign up to meet with you? Let's use the same link we did last time, except oops, I'm going to have to change some times. We're going to do. Send it out again? Sorry. Yes, I can. I'll send it here in the chat, actually. Thank you. All right. So let's just so we can take a small break. Let's start at 340. Do we have to meet with you? Nope. If you don't have anything to say, you don't need to meet. And we've, I kind of wanted to know what you're doing for packaging, most of all, and see your finished MOPOs. So if you don't have those things, um, well, if you have questions on how you're going to proceed, I suppose. Okay. Well, Brent, do you want us to turn those in on Learning Suite or just email them to you? Uh, no, Learning Suite, so I can grade more easily. Thanks. Okay. Hey, if I want to go and use like one of the actually good computers on campus, uh, how am I able to get into any room? <laughs> if the HVAC is still open, you sh your BYU ID card should let you into the D513 lab. Do I have to like swipe it or does it just tap swipe it? Swipe it. Is it referring I, to like we still also need a mask and rubber gloves. <laughs> What's that? And some Clorox wipes. Okay, cool. It's a vertical swiper like the Rezo Lab. If you've uh, ever tried to get in with your card down there, which you probably haven't. I haven't. Um, but yeah, I requested permission for all of you guys, so all of you can get, if the HVAC is open, can get into D513 or A440. What is Beth showing us? A cookie. Oh, she just dropped it. <laughs> we can't hear you. We can just see you. <laughs> my fiance's roommate just gave me a crumble, and then I dropped it on my hand. Oh my goodness. That's from a cookie? That looks crazy. <laughs> what did you tell them? So, <laughs> yep. <laughs> Good problem to have. Um, how many people think they want an individual appointment today, just so I know how many appointments I need to make? I do. Should we just raise hand? Yes. <laughs> do the hand raised icon. <laughs> Beth, oh, ben, a real ant kind. Jared. Okay, so this is enough. These are this will be sufficient time slots. I don't know if any of you have already gotten on here and put your name in, but I'm gonna sweep all the names that are currently here. Do it. Steph. That's who's missing, Steph Driggs. Okay, well, that's all I have for you today. Unless you have further questions, we can adjourn. So are we still signing up or are you sending out the list? Sorry. Here's the link right here. Oops, let me copy that again. Oh, good. I can't find it in my email. Bye, everyone. Bye, Dom. Bye. Bye, Dom. Bye. Bye. Yo. Yo. Sorry to the person that was trying to take three fifty, and I just took it. <laughs> Swiped. Doing.